For more than 100 years, we've connected to the electric power grid to supply energy for our vital needs. Today, we use electricity to power our lights, air conditioners, electronics, and even transportation. As our power needs have grown, our grid has grown with it, becoming stronger and more integrated. Today, with rooftop solar, battery power storage, and new digital technologies, the grid is connecting us in new ways. The grid's not just our connection to electricity, it's a network that connects us to our neighbors and communities. That connectivity gives our power supply reliability, stability, and quality. The grid's diverse range of power generation delivers electricity from plants that run 24-7. When a plant outage occurs, another plant is ready to take its place. In the U.S., on average, the grid provides power 99.97% of the time. That's all but two and a half hours per year. It also provides stability and quality. For example, when air conditioners and refrigerators cycle on, they require a short burst of power to get started. The grid delivers power at the right voltage and frequency to ensure safe, efficient operation. The grid's powerful dynamic balancing of supply and demand is invisible to us, but essential to every electrical appliance and system. Is solar technology making the grid obsolete? No. In fact, solar technology is making the network more valuable than ever. Solar panels are excellent when the sun shines, but when it's dark or cloudy, the grid is still an essential source of energy. Also, as a network, the grid delivers excess power from solar panels in one place to others elsewhere on the system. The grid becomes more dynamic, more interdependent, and more valuable than before. Batteries, too, can serve us as consumers and the grid. They store excess solar energy when it's available to use when the sun doesn't shine. So why not use solar and batteries to go completely off the power grid? Can't storage take the place of the grid? Remember the grid's reliability, stability, and quality? To get these benefits without a network, you'll need to buy a very large battery and a lot of solar panels. Your electricity from this system can cost 10 times as much on average compared to electricity from the grid. Now your very expensive equipment must perform a challenging balancing act. On cloudy days, the panels won't produce enough power and you'll rely on battery backup while it lasts. And on days with lots of sun, the panels will produce more power than the batteries can store, wasting up to two-thirds of the generated power. But when you're connected to the grid's network of producers and consumers, you can sell your clean, renewable power, making it available to others. It may be enough to pay for the cost of connection, with money left over. And this energy means savings on fuel and reduced emissions elsewhere on the grid. As both a power producer and consumer, you can use the grid to provide the power you need and provide renewable energy for purchase and use by others. Unlike you, the grid never sleeps. Your grid connection works every night and day, connecting you and other customers to millions of workers in power plants, transmission and distribution centers, line crews, and customer service centers. The team is always innovating and finding better ways to provide safe, clean, and reliable power for our growing complex demands. If a power plant needs an overhaul or a wind topples a tree on a line, these dedicated people fulfill a mission that is essential to modern life. Safe, reliable, affordable, environmentally responsible electric power for everyone. Yes, rooftop and battery storage can work in isolation, but when they're connected through the grid, they provide a more reliable, stable, and affordable source of electricity. These energy resources work best together enhancing a powerful, precision-engineered power system. For more information on how traditional infrastructure supports the adoption of new power technologies, look for the Integrated Grid on epri.com.